Hello and welcome to Sam Biology class. Friends, today we shall discuss about meganucleases. Meganucleases are sequence specific endonucleases that create double stranded breaks at specific locations in the DNA. These enzymes are encoded by mobile genetic elements. Several hundred meganucleases have been identified. These enzymes are present in all three domains of life such as the archaea, bacteria and the eukaryota. Meganucleases have exploited all possible genetic loci by locating themselves in the nuclear, organellar and viral genomes and also in plasmids and transposons. These enzymes are characterized by very large recognition sites which are double-stranded DNA sequences having 14 to 44 base pairs. Unlike restriction enzymes which provide defense to bacteria against invading DNAs, meganucleases facilitate the lateral mobility of genetic elements within an organism. This process is called as homing. Because of this, meganucleases are also called as homing endonucleases. Homing endonucleases are considered to be the most specific, naturally occurring restriction enzymes. They are molecular DNA scissors that are used to replace, eliminate or modify sequences in a highly targeted way. By changing their recognition sequence through protein engineering, their targeted sequence can also be changed. Based on the presence of conserved amino acid motifs, four families of homing endonuclease genes have been proposed. These families are first one is the HNH, number two the histidine system box, number three GIYYAG, and finally the fourth one is the LAG LIDADG family of homing endonucleases. Out of these four, the LAG LIDADG family of homing endonucleases have been used as a variable tool for the study of genome and genome engineering for past 15 years. The most widespread and best known homing endonucleases are members of LAG LIDADG family which are present in chloroplast and mitochondria of unicellular eukaryotic organisms. The best characterized meganucleases that are used in research and genome engineering are intron encoded endonuclease which was first discovered in the East, Saccharomyces cerevisiae, intron encoded endonuclease which was first discovered in Chlamydomonas reinhardi and intron encoded endonuclease in the Archibacterium disulfurococcus mobilis. Homing endonucleases function as homodimers or internally symmetrical monomers. One example is intron encoded endonuclease in Chlamydomonas reinhardi. This enzyme function is a homodimer in which two monomers associate to recognize a specific sequence which is 22 base pairs long. This enzyme cleaves at specific location in both strands of the DNA. Regarding application, homing endonucleases are promising tool for gene editing and genome engineering. So friends, this is all about meganucleases or homing endonucleases. For more updates, please subscribe my YouTube channel, Sun Biology Class.